Hello everyone, welcome to Great Online Training. This is Kavya. In this video, I'm going to explain the SAS Certified Specialist question number 21. Let me enter into the question number 21. The question number 21 says that there was a data set named input dot scores with 5 test commands test 1 to test 5. Compute the average score for each student and store in a new column named average score. And the question is asking her what is the highest average score in the above data? And the second question was filter the data set to include only students with an average score above 80 and how many students meet the criteria. The question says that there was a data set named input.scores with 5 test columns means we have 5 variables. The 5 variables are test 1 to test 5. Compute the average score for each student and store in a new column named average underscore score. We have to compute the average score for these test columns and we have to name those five test columns as a new variable named average underscore score. And the first question is what is the highest average underscore score in the above data? We have to do that by using the SAS environment. We have to know what is the highest average score. And the second question was Filter the data set to include only students with an average score above 80. How many students meet the criteria? And we want the students and we want the students who have an average score above 80. And how many students meet the criteria? The criteria was average score above 80 means the students who meet the average score of above 80. For this, let me open the SAS environment. And we know that he says there was a data set named scores which is present in the input library. For the input library, let me create the input library by using the lib name statement. And let me copy the path which is present in my desktop in the form of data. And copy the path. Paste it here. And the semicolon. And run the statement. And check the log if there are any address. Log says that library of input was successfully created. And in the input library, we want the data set named as scores. Let me open the data set. As the question asks, we have the five variables named test1 to test5 for each student. So for this, let me enter into the question first of all, what the question was asked actually. The question asked is, Compute the average score for each student and store in a new column named average underscore score. For this, let me write the data step and data average underscore score set. By using the set statement, we have to write the uh, input dot scores because we are taking the scores data set from the input library. We want the average score for each student. So the average score can be computed as the mean form. So let me use the average score by using the SIPRIN statement in your variable. Average score is equal to mean of test1 to test5. And run statement. If we have not mentioned the off statement here, it will take the symbol as the minus and we will get the unappropriated result. So we have to keep the off statement when we have this type of variables. Means var1 to var5, test1 to test5. Means the same variables we have, we have to write the off statement. Otherwise it will take as a subtraction. So we have to write the off statement for the average score. So let me run the statement. Check the log. The log says that there were no errors. And open the data set named average score. We can see here a new variable is created and we have every average score for each student. Like every observation we have the average score. So we have done about this. And the question asking is what is the highest average score in the above data? The highest average score means the maximum score. For this let me use a proc statement. Proc SQL. But the data statement will take a long process, so I'm using this and select the variable as a average score. We want the maximum, right? So max, average underscore score. And I will create a new variable as max underscore average underscore score. 
from the data set average underscore score and with quit statement run the program we can see the maximum score was 95 and the first question answer is 95 is the maximum highest average score and the second question was fill the data set to include only students with an average score above 80 how many students meet the criteria for this let me create the data statement data average underscore scope 1 and by using the set statement as average underscore score and for here I will use the where statement to get the values which are greater than 80 average score greater than 80 and the run statement let me write the print because we can see the results visually in the output and see here we have got the 11 observations and the students who scored average scores above 80 are 11 students so the second question answer was 11 means who meet the criteria or 11 students the first question answer was 95 and the second question answer was 11 observations means 11 students meet the criteria if you have any doubts in the above video please comment in the comment box if you are liking this video, please like the video, share the video to your friends and colleagues who need the SAS certification. And if you want to learn the best SAS certification, you can log in into the great online training channel and the link that was given below the comment box. And thank you for watching. Thank you.